Hello, I'm Francesca Page. President Obama says the bill allowing Congress final approval on the Iran nuclear deal was reasonable. My basic argument was, let us show you if there's a deal or not. If there is, you'll have ample opportunity to review it and uh, opine on it. But right now we're still negotiating, so have some patience. The president says he was concerned that Congress would derail the negotiations. A deadline for the final framework on the nuclear deal is set for June. And former Arkansas Governor Mike Huckabee plans to make an announcement about a possible presidential run tonight. A spokesman for the former Arkansas Governor tweeted this message, telling reporters to watch Special Report with Brett Baer. Huckabee appears to be gearing up for a White House run. He's traveled around the early primary states, and in January, he left his Fox News show. And an Ohio man accused of plotting a terror attack on American soil is expected in federal court today. Prosecutors say Abdi Amin Sheikh Mohammed was trained by terrorists in Syria and then returned home with plans to attack a military base or a prison. They say he talked about traveling to a base in Texas to try and kill soldiers execution style. And the fight over the president's executive orders on immigration focuses on New Orleans today. A three-judge federal ap appeals court panel will hear arguments over an order that's blocking the president's moves. If the order is lifted, the president's executive actions would shield millions from deportation. And President Obama taking some of his work out in the sun. On a day like today, we shouldn't be inside. He signed off a bipartisan piece of Medicare reform. It permanently changes how Medicare pays doctors and ends the need for a fix that Congress had to approve every year for more than a decade. And an Oregon woman's been in court this week facing charges that she killed two handymen and fed their remains to her pigs. Susan Monica claims one of the workers actually shot himself on her property before the pigs dragged the body away. She says the other handyman was attacked by her pigs and she shot him as a mercy killing. And the bodies of five people have been found in an Arizona home after a standoff with police. Police in Phoenix are still trying to piece together exactly what happened. But it appears one of the three men who died killed the other four before killing himself. And Italian police say Muslim migrants making their way on a boat from Libya pushed 12 Christian migrants overboard. Fifteen people were detained Wednesday night. They're being charged with multiple murder, aggravated by religious hate. The Christian migrants who died after being shoved overboard were from Ghana and Nigeria. And strong storms have been plowing through parts of the Midwest. This tornado touched down in western Oklahoma near the Texas border. Other twisters were reported in Texas and Kansas. So far, no word on injuries or damage. That is your latest Newsmax Now update. More is coming your way in 30 minutes. Always stay connected with us at Newsmax.com.